Hey folks, we're getting to the end of 2015 and therefore it is a good time to step back and think about what 2015 meant for all of us, the five big things that I would pick to say here's why they were important for 2015 and really what it means for 2016 and beyond. How can I or anyone not pick climate change as one of the most fundamental deep topics of today? But here's the interesting thing about climate change. The problem with climate change is that you don't see it every day. Of course you see pollution every day, but really is it impacting you in, a, in, a, in such a significant way that you can't live? And the answer is no. The problem with climate change is that it has a deep impact over a very long time that's completely irreversible. So what I thought was a fundamental event of 2015, actually towards the end of 2015, was the climate change agreement. Now, we'll all argue that actually the agreement is just a piece of paper that countries have come together and signed. And like many other pieces of paper, the reality is every country has to endorse it and it actually has to become a reality, etc. And that is a long way away. But the fact that 100 plus countries came together and signed it. So let's, let's put this down here, climate change. And, and within that, obviously one will talk about things like pollution, energy conservation, and on and on and on. These will have a deep impact on the way we all live. I mean, let's take, let's talk about where I am right now, Delhi, Gurgaon. Uh, we, we know the pollution here. We know that starting from the 1st of January, uh, the government is actually gonna try out for 15 days odd and even cars on the road. I talked about the fact earlier that, that all of us as citizens have to participate. We should not take shortcuts. I also talked about the fact that us in Jetpack and all of us in Genpak who are here will participate and will actually make sure that it works because we have people who go back and forth as part of their jobs. Um, but, but it's important to think about uh, all of us in our different roles participating in finding a way to drive climate change in the right direction. And that includes renewable energy, participating in using new technologies, uh, the R&D work that happens with new technologies, supporting companies that actually are in that space. A lot of our clients are in that space. So, so I see this as an interesting role, me as a citizen, you as a citizen, us as a corporation, us as a company, helping climate change almost reverse itself. So that's what I thought about that, uh, about that topic. Uh, would love to hear your views, your reactions. Really curious to understand what you think. Um, okay to agree, disagree. Uh, you can reach me on my Twitter handle. You can uh, contact me on LinkedIn. Uh, would love to hear your views and looking forward to it.